I'll go prep, prep, prep it up. Science, math, we can't get enough. Learn with friends, friends, friends all day. Argo prep helps us find the way. Hi there, amazing students. I'm Dr. Stella Spark, and I'm thrilled to meet you all. I'm a pediatrician, which means I take care of children when they're not feeling well. But guess what? In my spare time, I absolutely love teaching science to wonderful students like you. I'm part of the Argo Prep universe, where learning is always an adventure. You might see me helping other Argo Prep characters when they're feeling under the weather whether it's giving Miles some cold medicine or checking Princess Lernia's temperature. I make sure everyone feels better and ready to learn. Today, I will be teaching you about matter. Here's what we'll discover in today's video. One, what matter is. Two, four important properties of matter. And three, how to observe these properties in the world around us. First, Let's talk about what matter is. Can you look around you right now? Everything you see is made of matter. That's right, your chair, your clothes, even the air around you is matter. Matter is anything that takes up space. Now, here's the cool part. All matter has special characteristics or properties that we can observe. Today, we're going to learn about four important properties. 1. Hardness, 2. Weight, 3. Texture, and 4. Flexibility. Let's start with hardness. Hardness is how tough an object is. For example, a rock is very hard, but a marshmallow is soft. Can you think of something that's hard? How about something soft? Now, I want you to pause the video and find two objects in your home. One that's hard and one that's soft. Go ahead, I'll wait right here. Welcome back! Did you find your objects? In my home, I found a coffee mug which is hard and a soft fluffy pillow. What did you find? Now. Let's talk about weight. Weight is how heavy something is. A feather has very little weight, but a big book is much heavier. Let's try another home exploration. Pause the video again and find something heavy and something light in your home. You're back! Excellent work! I found a heavy dictionary and a light feather from my pet parrot. What did you find? Next up is texture. Texture is how something feels when we touch it. It could be smooth like the floor, rough like sandpaper, or bumpy like a pine cone. Time for another pause. Find two objects with different textures in your home. Welcome back. I found a smooth marble and a rough pine cone from my garden. What interesting textures did you find? Describe how they feel. Finally, let's talk about flexibility. Flexibility is how easy it is to bend something without breaking it. A rubber band is very flexible, but a wooden pencil is not. Find something flexible and something not flexible in your home. Great job! Let me tell you what I found. I found a flexible leather belt. I could bend the leather belt easily. I also found a wooden spoon in my kitchen which is not flexible. I tried to bend it, but I could not. What did you find? Wow, you're all doing an amazing job. Let's do a quick recap of what we learned today. One. Matter is anything that takes up space. Two, we can observe matter's properties like hardness, weight, texture, and flexibility. Three, hardness is how tough something is. 
Four, weight is how heavy something is. Five, texture is how something feels when you touch it. And six, flexibility is how easy it is to bend something without breaking it. Now, here's a fun question for you. If you could design a new toy, what properties would you want it to have? Would it be hard or soft? Heavy or light? What texture would it have? Would it be flexible? Think about it and share your idea with a grown-up. Then draw the design of your toy on a piece of paper and write about it. Great job, everyone. You've been fantastic scientists today. And now, <gasps> what's this? My science senses are tingling. Can you feel it too? There's something extraordinary in the air. Oh, my microscopes and test tubes. Do you see that glowing light? It's getting brighter and brighter. It can only mean one thing. It's the phenomenal, the spectacular, the one and only Argo Star. This Argo Star is proof of your amazing work today. Every time you watch one of our videos and learn new things, you'll have a chance to earn an Argo Star. The more you learn, the more stars you'll collect. Isn't that awesome? In our next video, we'll do some fun experiments to explore these properties even more. This is Dr. Stella Spark signing off from the Argo Prep Science Universe. Had fun spinning through science with us? The adventure doesn't have to end here. Join us at argoprep.com for more awesome discoveries. Subscribe now and continue your journey through the Argo Prep universe. Let's make learning and adventure together. Visit argoprep.com and start learning today.